Is your debt causing you sleepless nights? Knock your debt out with Debt KO. And your debt won't be the only thing keeping you up at night. Debt KO, free impartial advice on all your debt. This is something that comes along every now and then in generation and it's special. Everyone wants to talk about the possibility of Joshua versus Tyson Fury, but there's obviously uh, Alexander Usyk who could stand in the way if that title, the WBO, I believe, uh, has to be vacated if he doesn't defend first against Usyk. His manager said that they'd be willing to listen to a step-aside offer. If you were his manager, what would the monetary figure be that would satisfy you to say, all right, you two go at it, we'll wait for the winner? Um, you know, I've obviously worked very closely with Alexander Usyk and Aegis Klimas is, you know, I class him as a friend. They're in a strong position where they know they're the mandatory challenger. But at the same time, we have a fight on our hands and sorry to the governing bodies that eclipses all belts. And we just got to be a little bit careful because you may be on the verge of going, do you know what? Let's just get rid of politics right now. Let's just drop all the belts. Because if we lose one belt, we might as well lose them all. And then you have to pay sanctioning fees. Exactly. And step aside. So, you know, it gets to a stage where you've got the biggest fight in world boxing. You're paying each governing body hundreds and hundreds of thousands of dollars. Now you've got another guy who probably wants seven figures to step aside. So we just got to be careful because ultimately the aim of this fight has always been to be for the undisputed championship. When Anthony Joshua came into my office many years ago, that was always the dream. And we will do whatever we can to make sure that every belt in boxing is on the line in the Tyson Fury fight. What we won't be and we, what we won't do is we won't be held to ransom and we won't let politics get involved in a, in a fight that boxing needs, right? We've been, uh, you know, we've done YouTube events, right? You saw the other day Mike Tyson against Roy Jones do a fantastic number on pay-per-view. 1.8 million. Exactly, supposedly. <laughs> if, if, we, if we don't start making these kind of fights, then that kind of thing will become the norm. I don't mind it, sprinkled in. But we have to remember what is great about our sport, and that is the best versus the best. 2021 needs to bring us Joshua against Fury. 2021 needs to bring us Chocolatito against Estrada. 2021 needs to bring us Errol Spence against Terence Crawford. And we don't mind saying fighters on our platform, The Zone, who are with other platforms because we want the best fights and we have to continuously try and raise the bar otherwise people will get bored with the sport and find an alternative so belts or no belts you will see fury against joshua but we hope that everyone is sensible everyone uses common sense and that great fight can be for the undisputed championship of the world this is something that comes along every now and then in generation and it's special Is your debt causing you sleepless nights? Knock your debt out with Debt KO. And your debt won't be the only thing keeping you up at night. Debt KO, free impartial advice on all your debt.